This is Jacob. Hello? Uh, yes, you can transfer them. Yes, this is Jacob. Who's speaking? Ohio Power Tool? No way. Yes? It's in? I'll be right there. This is gonna be so awesome. Can't wait, can't wait. Can't wait, can't wait. Wait, workshop, workshop. Ooh, pack out stuff. All right, pack up, pack up. Pack up, pack up. All right, here, let me turn this camera around and let's get this video started. What's going on? You guys are gonna like this. I'm gonna show you something I got, but, and, uh, this is not comfortable. Oh, who's that? Ooh, oh, Jake's girl. Uh, I gotta get changed. So hold on a second. There, that's much better. So I've got some stuff I'm gonna show you. Let me get this thing set up on the the little holdy camera thingy, doodad. I know it's a tripod. I just like calling stuff by complicated names. Be right back. What's going on? Officially, welcome. Hi, Jacob all here. I hope you liked my little intro shenanigans. So, uh, this year you guys might have seen something where Ohio Power Tool and a bunch of our other lovely Milwaukee dealers were able to get something that only Home Depot got last year. Well, today I got something awesome from Ohio Power Tool. I'm gonna show it to you. I'm gonna show you a couple things you guys have asked me to show you. So, it's your fault for this video. But last year around holiday time, I got me this which is a uh, Milwaukee SAE pack out with the socket set. It's got the nice little tray, right? And I 
personally like these sockets so far. And that right there is so pretty. But a lot of you, like me, are looking for 10 millimeter sockets. So, when I got this call today, I was thrilled. Pack out. Look at that. Oh, it's backwards. 32 piece. Metric. That's right. They're in. So if you guys have pre-ordered these, you're gonna start getting calls from whoever you got it from. Hopefully you got it from Ohio Power Tool, because come on. Boop, boop. So yeah, socket set. Let's take a look. You know, I know for sure that I was smarter than the box. Apparently, oh. the glare, the shininess, and yes, I will need a knife because there's a zip tie. I'm gonna do it. Open it upside down. I can't remember if the SAE, the standards that I got from Home Depot had the little condom or not, but look at that prettiness. And look, it does exist. See that? 10 millimeter. That's nice. Also comes with, you know, your normal Milwaukee porn. And a little guarantee, call 1-800-SAWDUST or email, product description, photograph, name, shipping address. That's all you gotta do. Lifetime guarantee. So it's made in China like Craftsman, but at least they're not gonna lie and go based off some heritage of a brand. So there it is, in the, in the flesh. Scoop them back. Look at that. That is some nice sexiness. So, yeah, the Jake's girl's over here laughing. So you guys have asked for this, so I'm gonna go ahead and give you these teasers, right? So you've got both of these and you say that I don't wanna pay the 300 and some dollars to get this one. So let's look at it and see what it looks like. So this here and this here. There you go, fits, and obviously black, red, gotta love it, pretty simple. Let's try some other ideas, shall we? Because you guys have asked about this, and I think the answer is going to be yes, we can do it, but let's, uh, let's actually find out. Actually, I really should leave these out. I don't know why I keep putting these back in. So, let's see. Full size pack out. You guys asked if two of them would fit in here in one side. So they've got these little hanging tabs that keep it sort of suspended, right? But I don't see why you couldn't tuck it, tuck, tuck, fold it in. So, okay, so right now it's hitting because the way the taper is, but let's 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 just cram it in there, right? Because sometimes that's what you gotta do. Okay, get the other one. Let's let's do the let's do the hang about that. Way. So alright, so first problem 
Let me, let me show you this. First problem I see. Okay, you see how far those are? What's gonna keep that from popping out and hitting the lid? So on the standard depth pack out, I'm gonna say no, that is not gonna work. Yes, they physically fit, but this really needs to be up higher uh, for the lid to be able to keep the stuff in the pack out. If you look at this one, look at how close that is to the lid. It's not going to do the same in there. Uh, you could definitely do it. I just don't think I would. And I think your sockets are going to get knocked out of place. I know a couple of people have shown, put some Kaizen foam in here, put your M12 stubby. If I even still have mine or if somebody hasn't walked off of it. Right, so take this guy. Put it over here in some Kaizen foam. Look, it's dirty. So that would definitely work. So I'm thinking, no, you're not gonna wanna use this, but if you have already bought the one from Home Depot, then grab this and now you've got both your standard and your uh, metrics, metric in one pack out. I'd say that's a win pretty easy. I didn't have to spend $300 and now I've got both. So I'm pretty happy. I like the little take. I like the nice black tray. Obviously you'll be able to uh, tell the difference between the two. I was trying to see here real quick if there's anything else that you'll quickly notice between the two in the sets. So Forty-eight dash twenty-two dash ninety dash thirty-eight. So these are the same part numbers from the uh, ratchet itself. That would make sense. The swivels look to be the same, same length. Extensions look to be the same. The layout, as you can see, is a little different on these. Start at eight millimeter, goes to 18 here, there's a 19. Uh, these wrap around on the red, they don't on the black. But overall, ooh, I think Milwaukee yeah, they figured that out better. Okay, so if you watch, listen. All right, and I'm going to take one out of here. So see how I can, I'm going to use my whittle pinky, and I'm just going to stick it in here, and I'm just going to pro it up like that. See how easy that was? Now, I'm going to take the same fragile little pinky, and I'm going to stick it in here. I'm going to hunt my pinky. I cut, get it. Oh, yeah, shot it. So that was with my pinky, and now it's damaged. It's a wee little pinky. <laughs> so here, barely. It's it's held in place. I wouldn't flip it upside down. You you can't flip this set upside down anyways because of this. So it's not like Milwaukee did it to make it you know flip proof because the rest of this would fall. But on this case, so much easier to get these in and out. I complained about that on one of my first videos. Uh, a couple of people did ask, will you do me a favor? Will you grab me over there in the center Craftsman toolbox, the center tray, grab me like a uh, 17 and like a 14 millimeter. No, Craftsman toolbox. All the way to the left, the sockets. All the way, keep going. Yes, that's the stuff. Give me like a 16 and a 17 millimeter. The long ones. Ones that look like this. Oh my lord. I'll be back, camera people. It's in the tray. You were just in. Oh, these are the long ones. These aren't the long ones. Yeah. All right. 
after that brief fast forward. Okay, so I'll take some stock Craftsman's. So we tried to fit these in here before, but I tried like a three quarter, the three quarter as tight as this was, wasn't gonna fit. So I'm gonna try a 16 millimeter Craftsman in a 16 millimeter Milwaukee hole. It's not gonna happen. Okay, so I'm gonna try a 17 millimeter. A 17, yeah, not gonna happen. You're gonna, you're gonna totally overforce that. So, here you go, you can put these back. Now, you know where they go? Mm -hmm. All right, so, so what's different? Mainly, basic layout, but they fixed this molding to not be as tight, which is nice, because you can get these out with one finger, or a wee little pinky. All of them, look at this, pinky. Out. Oh, it's so nice. Look, not a pinky, whatever that finger is, middle finger, right? Got it right out, no problem. This side, it's, that one's actually not so bad. Oh, those take, oh, wow, those things, oh, it's like, ah, oof, ah. Okay, it's not that bad, but it's, you can hear it clicking, and you can hear on this one, or not here. Barely, like, like, either side you want to grab these from. Easy, this one, you have to go from that side, otherwise you'll hurt your pinky. So there you go, there's something different. I hope you guys like this. I hope you, uh, you got as much out of this as I did. I was, I've honestly not used this at all. I just wasn't gonna use it. I'm like, I'm not gonna do it until the metrics, metric comes out. No, I'm kidding, I've used it a little bit, but I'm gonna use it more. So there we go, nice little comparison. I hope you liked it and I promise, in one of my last YouTube videos, I've been busy doing some of the bit instructional videos that, uh, hey Penny, would you grab me that little circular saw? That thing. Yes. Yep, grab me that big thing and come bring it around here. Nothing like a kid delivering a saw. Are you gonna do something with it? No. Are you gonna cut my stomach open? <laughs> so I'm gonna give this away. I said that in my last video, I was gonna give that away. We're not gonna give this away. <laughs> but, uh, so, I'm, I'm not gonna use some fancy algorithms and guessers and things like that. I'm just gonna use her. So, she's been spying on y'all and creeping and checking out your profiles. So, Jake's girl, Pack Out Princess, who's gonna win this? Uh, who's we, gonna win this? We are gonna go with Gearhead. 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 That, that's just Gearhead? Okay, look, I'll show you. Oh, she's gonna show us. Gearhead, you're gonna win this. We'll comment on the other video, but I'm going to re release okay. that in this one. This is, can you see it? It's all fuzzy. Gearhead, right there. That one. What is the video? So. Gearhead. Oh, it's a commercial. We'll comment. Uh, I'm going to, if I can put the blade in the box and lay it flat, I will. Otherwise, you might get this without a blade. Don't take my phone away from me. But I'm it's a complete saw. No problems. It works. Somewhere on here, stuffed under the handle is even the Allen wrench to get the blade off. It's all there. Appreciate you commenting. Thanks everyone else for watching. Uh, this was just a simple, hey look, when I do that, am I recreating this shirt? <laughs> I mean, I'm not as awesome as Abe, but you know, I got, I got cool family and I get to play with tools and y'all like seem to like to watch. So I'm, uh, I'm gonna be done with this one. It's already 14 minutes and I just wanted to do a quick one. I've got a couple new things that you may or may not have seen. I got something for that M12. Hey, Penny, grab me that real quick and then I can say goodbye to these fine folks. The drill that's standing up and then those cup holders and that battery thing. Yep, 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 all that stuff right there. Good job. See, kids are helpful sometimes. Battery. So blocking, back out foot, blocking, cup holder, the M12 install tool with what everyone on Instagram decided to call the Jake stand. This thing's pretty nice. So one of the problems with this is that when you set it down with that extended battery, that it falls over, it doesn't now. And then these suckers, watch this, put it in the pack out, turn it. Now you have a cup holder and you can have it for the M12 batteries and we have it for the M18. So you can take your beverage, it's locked into your pack out. That's it. Those are new on the site. We also, you might've seen if you're watching YouTube, 
I uh, have the vac out pack out kit for the Milwaukee M18 wet dry vac that basically gives you everything you need except for the vacuum cleaner to lock it into a pack out. So that's on the site, store.jacobo.com. Appreciate you guys watching. I'm gonna get ahead in because I'm tired and I don't have air conditioning out here. And this one, if I stay too long, she starts doing handstands. So uh, that's Jake's girl. That's Penny. I'm Jake of all. And it's time to pack out. Pack out. See ya. There's a kid coming. Outtake. Yeah. Get in, close the door. We're shooting a video. Get in, close the door. We're shooting a video. Shaggy.